If you think you've seen more fluttering around your flower beds this spring, you're not alone. Butterfly sightings are flying into John Klimko's office from all across the Maritimes. This spring was an exceptional year for many migrant species, uh, things like Red Admiral, American Lady, Painted Lady, and Question Mark. Many of the species that come back to eastern Canada every spring after spending the winter in warmer climates. The very warm spring uh, experience throughout eastern North America has allowed them to reach very high numbers and they arrived in the Maritimes very early and in huge numbers and also across all of eastern Canada. John has recorded hundreds of early sightings. He's trying to keep track of just how many species are out there and he needs some help from Maritimers. We are asking participants to submit photographs or specimens of butterflies that they see uh, in their gardens, at their house, or when they're out specifically looking for butterflies. And then register them on this website because John is putting together a butterfly atlas. The goal is to monitor the migration and flight patterns of rare species and of those vulnerable to climate change. It's important to identify which ones are truly rare so that we can focus our conservation efforts on protecting those species. But why put so much effort into researching what most people think is just sort of a flower with wings? Butterflies act somewhat as a barometer for the overall quality of our ecosystems. So when we start losing rare species, it just indicates that we're having an overall degradation of those ecosystems, which I think should be cause for concern for we all rely on those uh, for our food, for our living. So the butterfly is much more than just a pretty bug. For the Weather Network, I'm Shelley Steves in Sackville, New Brunswick.